if you have a locomotive that is not responding to your factory reset or uh, somehow the locomotive is uh, just not accepting any CVs that you are writing or reading from it or sometimes if your locomotive is giving you only uh, 255 uh, as a read value uh, on your CVs so that is an indication of that uh, there is something wrong with the locomotive and the setting has been changed so the same thing happened with me I have this uh, Penn Central 6514 locomotive and uh, this uh, this locomotive was working very nice but recently when I tried to uh, I tried to consist it with my another locomotive which is this one uh, Southern 3088 okay so what happened that well it this was the primary loco and then the pen central was the, the secondary loco that just got into into the consist uh, but as I uh, deleted the consist uh, this loco was working fine but this loco was just not responding to my throttles so uh, I was just searching the internet and searching the forums what could be the wrong uh, but I didn't find any answer for this problem yet I I have a Lice DCC decoder installed in this. Uh, it's very cheap decoder and it's very good for uh, just uh, running your trains on DCC. So um, I also asked the uh, the company about the possibility of how to reset this locomotive, and they did uh, told me that I had to reset uh, it with uh, maybe the factory reset option in your uh, control panel or um, maybe you can use uh, softwares and use factory reset functions like uh, like I'll show you if you go to the okay so we are now in the panel pro and what you need to do is just go to the tools programmers and select single semi programmer okay now uh, in order to reset my this particular de decoder what I need to do is to write into CV number 8 the value of 4 okay that's that's what I need to do so that's what I'm going to do is to write CV number 8 the value of 4 and I will select the direct byte option here okay I won't change anything here I'll just say write let me just put my logo here before doing that we will need to do a power on for the track and now I say write okay just put the address here and say write okay write okay now it says here okay so well if my the, the the loco that I am having is correctly uh, configured but if you have a loco that's not responding to any CVs you won't see any address here or if you uh, if you have this in your consist and then you should select uh, 127 here because that's the address you get when uh, when you have done a consisting for this loco so in many cases this this should be 127 for the address uh, if you don't know the address of your local uh, and you also have to select the direct byte and just say right but right now it won't work because the address is not changed so see it, do it doesn't recognize that so you can just uh, because the address is now 3 so it will now work with 3 address so that's how you you have to write a single CVs to your local if you have any problem with a particular CV because uh, if you try to write uh, the CV number 8 from a decoder pro or the, the programmer the, uh, let's say if you go to the program menu here and you also have CVs here but but these CVs don't have option to write to CV number 8 because as you see this is disabled this option is not available to write so you cannot change anything here and write it so you have to use panel pro and uh, go to tools and programs programmers and just select single C programmer and that way you should be able to 
make your logo run again properly. I hope this video is helpful for you and see you in the next video. Thank you.